Hey guys, what's up? We're on episode 2 of Twin Saga. So where we last left off, we killed the purple chicken and we found the, the poor red chicken that was lost. And we brought him back to the kid and last thing we heard from him was help me. I think I did a bad thing. Bring him back, but hey, it's either the red bird or my achievements. All right. Remember this: we eat the cookie. Well, oh, pie. That, well, that looks like a Halloween cookie. Look at the detail. I believe I'm on high graphics. The highest one. Last I played, I was on highest. Those clouds. And now we talk to her and things start to happen. Oh god. Yeah, I remember this. I love this part. It's funny because your character actually has dialogue itself. Now, throw the pie! I threw pie at you, bro. What are you gonna do about it? Gonna run? That's what I thought. Take your hooligans with you. You won't ever come back here. Ever again. Her name is Eleanor. Is that how you pronounce her name? You see a lot of Eleanor in this story, so get used to seeing her around. Fuck. All I'm waiting for is when I get to Rogue. Rogue is gonna be so much fun. Everybody else keeps getting all these awesome pets from their first login, but all I get are my little chubby friends here, my little chubby birds. I have nothing gets you, my little chubby friend. All right, let's kill you guys. them all. All of them. Yeah. Dragonite kind of seems like more of an AOE focused character. Out of this game, all I would love is like a training spot to where I can practice all my skills. And some good combos. Oh, I'm done. I'm just gonna let you suffer all by yourself, okay? I killed all your friends and you're low HP, so... Bye, buddy. Alright, back to Eleanor. I'm just looking over here at this blue fire drake. I really want it, but I can never get it. Oh, 
Oh god, I have never seen that before. What is that thing? Like a crocodile fish. Alright, now we talk to these people and they pretty much just give us items. And back to Eleanor. Now that we got all her items. I have all your items. There you go. Alright. Alright, one thing about this game you'll notice is that your summonings, or I can't really think that you'll call her a summoning. But the princess, or queen, I believe. At least she's the queen. I was not paying attention. She's one of them. At least she's the queen. But she pops up over here on your side like those uh, familiars did inside of AK. Roar Kingdom, for those of you guys who have never played AK. I was looking over in chat, people were talking about the bots. Uh, so I believe they're called Shikis. Uh, Shikis are... Pretty sure I'm saying it wrong. Ah, I'm just gonna call them Shikis. Shikis are basically like familiars that help you and aid you in battle. But I believe I get my first one after I finish this area though. Any green quests around? Oh, all the way over there. All right, now I have my mount, my cute and cuddly mount. I believe I won't have for very long until I'm actually done with everything. Yep, now we get our mount. And now we also get our uh, first skill points. For this class, I'm gonna go attack and HP. Wait, first, let me read these. Check grids on enemies. Hmm. Your damage stacks for four times. Uh, really? Was that really taking that long for you to do that? What jerks? Can I not read my skills in peace? Yeah, 
Yes, I am the chosen one. Thank you. Ow. Alright. See, told you. They pop up over here like those little familiars in AK. Yeah, dot damage. I like this side a lot better. Do I really want haste or... Eh. I'm gonna have a crap ton of HP as I go up anyway. Especially for my, like... What are they called? Uh, star stones? Oh, he shot at Eleanor. He's bad. Come on. Alright, uh... There we go. Defeat these lovable guys? Aw. Alright guys, I'm gonna have to kill you for no reason. They're not freaking out. They're just casually walking by enjoying life. What is this quest talking about? There's like some kind of event going on. A portal at has appeared. Is that like some kind of world boss? I don't think I should go to that because I've seen those world bosses and they're like extremely strong and you need like some of us are gonna need a lot of high rankers for it pretty sure a lot of people are like really over leveled considering that some of us don't read quests Like, I've read up to the point of, uh, Rogue, which is, like, very deep into the game. Like, around, like, level 37, I believe. That is where I last stopped. Here's where everything gets interesting. Now is my chance. Now what? Oh. Omar, my one of my favorite bosses. Well, favorite looking boss so far. I haven't got like extremely into the game yet. But so far he's the best looking boss to me. And his uh, voices in Japanese look, well, sound very like amazing. I love their little art right here. That's 
Like I said, that looks so amazing. This literally gives you a Kingdom Hearts feel. It's like what I said in my first impression. Gives you like a Kingdom Hearts and Final Fantasy feel. Guys, okay. Like a lot of. I wish I would have changed classes to Swordmaster and just wipe them all out. But I really want to try out uh, Dragon Knight a little bit more since I never played with him. He's sort of a new class to me. The only other game I know with like a Dragon Knight class is Eden Eternal. Okay, so my third skill pulls in an opponent, doesn't it? Yep, capture them and pulls them in. How long, how effective is it? Oh, it's at like medium range. Alright, how many of these guys are gonna summon me? Can we like really stop it? Thank you, like really. I'm summoning way too many of those things. Take this armor. Just die already. You can't defeat me. You will never defeat me. Still love that like Superman takeoff. The deeper vo voice is like the red Omar face, and the other voice is like the blue Omar face. What are you waiting for? Choose okay, which one do I want? Ready. Red, attack, attack. Now, here's where the Star Stone system comes in. Like, it's pretty much like runes or glyphs that you can actually equip to yourself. I'm gonna explain the system in a video as much as I can for you guys once I get like all of them. Alright, we're actually getting through this area very fast. Got a few more things to do. Okay, getting that out of the way is one of them. I have a lot more recording to do and a lot more editing. Since I am dealing with my gameplay channel too. Uh, the reason I haven't been uploading to the gameplay channel lately is just because I've been trying to get the MMO channel back on track. I've been uploading a lot of different videos from the um, from my MMO genre. It's like normal talking to you guys. 
Not that I don't like just sitting here talking to you guys. I just want to get the channel back on track to MMO videos. Alright, now we're going to get our piles of sticks. Well, wood, I guess. I'm still calling these sticks. Back to Eleanor. Eleanor is the needy person. She needs as much things as you can get. Thank you for that. Uh, wow, I have a lot of crap. Is there any merchants? Yep, there you are. Your backpack is going to get full really quickly, especially with, uh, Starstones as the game gets in. Get rid of these. These are pretty much just XP for your, um, Starstones. Everybody already advertising their guilds. Maybe I'll start a guild when I get 10 gold. Spider Guild worked out for a while. Then it went downhill. Yep. Okay, don't run over me. I knew that was what you were gonna do. You know what, I'm gonna ch change now. Cause I like... Swordmaster early game. That's why. He kills really fast. Because it's a spin to win. Next one. And last one. I don't see why this guy jumped in. I'm gonna put you out of your misery since you clearly wanted to die. Alright, we leveled. I don't know what I'm gonna do for this class though. Am I gonna make him tanky or am I gonna do make him a damage dealer? Kind of thinking of damage dealer right now. Uh, written attack, HP and defense. Well, I got Paladin that's coming up, so I might as well make him into like sword. He is a sword master. He's supposed to be like damage, I guess. So why not? Hmm. Now we get rid of these guys. Come on over here, buddy. Damn, boom. We are not done, now I get to talk to him. Alright, not as much as, like, lag. Yeah, pretty sure you're lag between uh, transferring from alone gameplay to back to open they do that a lot Uh, do I have any lower potions? Nope. I can open that. 
I can use this to uh, like make this go up a little. But right now I need a green, so I'm gonna equip a green. Leaping strike. All right, I'll take that. Because that's literally the next skill that's supposed to be coming out soon. Yep, there it is. Yep, those guys are dead. And now we go back to this guy. Swordmaster just makes everything so much easier. Just because that one skill. <laughs> and that skill is Bladestorm. You would think something like that would be on like a ninja character. Or rogue. This is called Bladestorm. But then again, it's Swordmaster. Master of all swords. Oh, we get these guys now? Hey, guy, what up? Okay, everybody's killing things again. Yep, this is like Air League access all over again. Guys, can can we talk about killing mobs right now? This is what I hate about like open beta. Everybody starts off at the same level and everything, and then we get to this point where everybody just can't get the mobs they want or need. Okay, really? You're interrupting my dialogue, sir. Go away. Wait, did it like cancel out? Oh my god. God darn it. That guy interrupted. But what if there is one down there? Didn't, what are you gonna say? Can I come too? I mean, PP pee Tom. <laughs> That's pretty much the quest. Oh, my mailbox is open. Oh, yeah. These. Oh, I forgot to check. Is uh, No, I don't think it's still for us, is it? Uh, let's see. Cart. Nope, we don't get free uh, loyalty points anymore. Rip. And like close beta, we got free loyalty points, like 50. No, I think it was like 500 or 250. Yeah, I think it was 500 that we got. Most definitely 500. All right, we're gonna talk to this guy, get everything done. Then we're gonna wrap it all up. Because we're getting towards our end game time. Not end game, I mean, uh. The end of this area. But I'm gonna go back and do the green quest in the next episodes. If I remember. Pretty sure I'll remember, because I like green quests. I'm gonna keep saying that. these dialogues I just don't know what to tell you guys I'm just trying to carefully scan through them so I don't like screw up all right there we go wait 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 we just put my point in it's that crit there we go
For the mayor's daughter, you're like extremely magical. I guess everybody in this game is magical, aren't they? Transformation. And we also fight this abomination again. Ah, oh, darn it, that's her. I couldn't get right back into the battling. Come on. Okay, okay, turn around. Oh god, he stunned me. Jesus. Please, god. Let me go. Yeah, they still have the dialogue, like, blending in with her skin. Like, this color text in her skin does not mix for some reason. Oh god, I guess they need to make those boxes, like, a little bit wider. And... piece of cake. Oh god. Looks like he's getting ready to Kamehameha us. Yeah, I knew I remember that voice from somewhere. I forgot what somebody told me. I think it was like sort of online maybe? That somebody said that her voice was from? I cannot remember. I'm gonna have to go back and look at that. I remember some of her, like, voices. Fat cats are recruiting. Alright, now we got our first... No, I'm just gonna call him a familiar. I don't know if we need to use that, but... Oh god. Oh god, that was loud. That wasn't even me leveling. That was somebody else leveling. Alright. Now we pretty much are stuck and cannot move. What? You cannot move until you complete the material. Oh. Okay. That was weird. I did not see that. Now that we equip her, she fights by our side like a familiar does in AK. Blessings are pretty much like... like your finisher skills. Like, you guys saw me doing a tutorial with that, uh, Lance guy. Or Dragonite. Now, we are pretty much done in this area. For, as for main quest. Right after we talk about this crap. About collecting all the, uh, Divine Drop. Well, Divine Tears. There we go. Now we don't actually get the like cavern or cabbage and like further into the game. This is pretty much just showing it off. Oh my god. Please ignore my yawning. Like, looking at this thing up close, it looks pretty awesome. 
Alright. So guys, with that said, we're gonna wrap all this up and put this skill right there and pretty much just tell me what you guys want me to do. If you guys want me to like skip through all the um, quests and or well skip through all the dialogue to the quests and just do all the quests or if you guys want me to like keep slowly scrolling through them pretty sure i'm gonna like go just speed through them considering that you guys are gonna be playing the game yourself and not just be watching me yeah i, I see you you there who don't want to play <laughs> but do make sure that you guys check out the game it's actually not bad it's actually pretty decent and you guys will actually enjoy it if you guys want you can add me in game and we can play together but until then i will see you guys next time peace out